instead of saying I can't, say I have a problem, people around you, yourself included, and the people around you, such as myself, a coach, uh, your friends, your support systems, your accountability partners, can help you when you say you're having a problem. If I say, hey, my car is having a problem, a mechanic can look at it. If I say, my car can't start, I can't go anywhere, no one can help me. Because guess what? I've already given up on trying to find the solution. I've already given up on trying to find the result. I've already given up on giving a fuck about getting in my car and going somewhere. I quit on myself. Instead, don't quit on yourself. Don't quit up here. Don't break yourself down up here. And don't break yourself down as a whole by saying you can't. Because the truth is, you can. And why can you? Because millions of millions of millions of people have come before you. And guess what? Whatever you're trying to accomplish right now in this very second, someone else has done it. So to be real honest with you, no matter how alone you feel in your problem, no matter how alone you feel in your struggle, no matter how hard you feel something is for you, you can do it. And you can do it because someone before you has also done it. Now, instead of ever saying you can't do something ever again, wipe that phrase from your vocabulary. Every time you say it moving forward, you should do 50 burpees. I never say I can't do something. I say I don't know how or I have a problem doing it. Because when I address it with both those frames, I'm allowing myself to get outside assistance, internal assistance, and build my confidence, not thinking I'm a know-it-all and not thinking I need to have the answers, but knowing that I can figure it out and use my resources and my resourcefulness to achieve the outcome.